Hello, can you believe the sitcom Steptoe and Son was released 61 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now? Who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Harry H. Corbett was born on February 28, 1925, in Rangoon, British Burma. He portrayed the character Harold Steptoe in the sitcom when he was 37 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1982, he passed away at 57, leaving us deeply saddened. I could go a nice sausage sandwich. We got no sausages. Well, couldn't you go out and get some then? No, we could. Yes, yes, so I'll go and get some sausages then. Actors are brilliant, and this is on a level that, uh, and to be snobbish, which is far and above the average kind of soap opera, and that's the killer. If you're mm. stuck in the type of soap opera. Wilfred Brambell was born on March 22, 1912, in Dublin, Ireland. He portrayed the character Albert Steptoe in the sitcom when he was 50 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1985, he passed away at 72, leaving us deeply saddened. Lovely bumps. That S is letting me in nice. S O D SOD! <laughs> Work well together, despite the fact that we only met when we were working. Because we lived different lives and miles apart. Yutha Joyce was born on August 20th, 1927, in Wandsworth, London, England. She portrayed the character Avis in the sitcom when she was 36 years old in 1963. We regret to inform you that in 1980, she passed away at 53, leaving us deeply saddened. Uh. <laughs> he says, hi George, and you say, lovely, thank you very much. And they say, uh, now if uh, he's not giving you what you want, darling, you, uh, you know, you come to me. That's lorry driving yeah. tank, you know. <laughs> Frank Thornton was born on January 15, 1921, in Dorwich, London, England. He portrayed the character Barman in the sitcom when he was 41 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 2013, he passed away at 92, leaving us deeply saddened. Just an itinerant street trader, your ladyship. Look more shop it before I belch you one. Um... I think we had vampires in it or something like that, very odd. I was just um, the manager of a clothing store, as far as I remember. Molly Sugden was born on July 21st, 1922, in Cayley, Yorkshire, England. She portrayed the character Auntie Minnie in the sitcom when she was 43 years old in 1965. We regret to inform you that in 2009, she passed away at 86, leaving us deeply saddened. They didn't suffer, you know. Didn't he? No, went out like a light. Went the way he wanted to with his boots on. <laughs> I don't expect his. It was big. All right. Is this your. I, I don't know. This, this is be... mine. Untouched. Okay. Who's going to touch? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's. Leonard Rossiter was born on October 21st, 1926, in Wavertree, Liverpool, England. He portrayed the character Johnny Spooner in the TV series when she was 38 years old in 1964. We regret to inform you that in 1984, he passed away at 57, leaving us deeply saddened. You're lucky I've done 39. <laughs> That's why I have to get out. I couldn't stand it anymore. I don't mind prison. It's him. Into reasons why you do things, I become actors. But I suppose looking back on it, you really want, I really wanted. Rita Webb was born on February 25, 1904, in Williston, Middlesex, England. She portrayed the character Auntie Ada in the sitcom when she was 61 years old in 1965. We regret to inform you that in 1981, she passed away at 77, leaving us deeply saddened. That's very nice! Using the presents before you get married! Well, that's that then! I won't be able to take them back to the shop now, will I? And while I'm about it... Do I can't, I couldn't, I couldn't. I can't, I can't go through with this, I can't. I can't let myself in for this, I just can't. No, I, I can't do it. I won't. June Whitfield was born on November 11, 1925, 
in Streatham, London, England. She portrayed the character Madge in the sitcom when she was 39 years old in 1964. We regret to inform you that in 2018, she passed away at 93, leaving us deeply saddened. Any more, aren't you? Well, uh, you see, son, it's like this. Oh, mind out. Look, see that? It's a engagement ring. Your dad and me's engaged. Oh, All right. Um, you she know, helped you out? She, well, she is so... Uh, I, I don't know, she just... Well, you met her, I mean, you know. Colin Gordon was born on April 27, 1911, in Caelan. He portrayed the character Mr. Greenwood in the sitcom when he was 51 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1972, he passed away at 61, leaving us deeply saddened. Painful. <laughs> He's never been the same man since. <laughs> and you've uh, claimed the marriage allowance ever since? Yes, but I can explain. George A. Cooper was born on March 7, 1925, in Leeds, West Riding of Yorkshire, England. He portrayed the character Uncle Arthur in the sitcom when he was 40 years old in 1965. We regret to inform you that in 2018, he passed away at 93, leaving us deeply saddened. Yes, he did. We'll be reading that when we come back. Is it worth hanging about for? Well, I'm sure we'll all be pleasantly surprised. He was quite comfortably off, you know, was George. He was entitled to be never spent anything. Anthony Sharp was born on June 16, 1915, in Highgate, London, England. He portrayed the character of Vicar in the sitcom when he was 55 years old in 1970. We regret to inform you that in 1984, he passed away at 69, leaving us deeply saddened. Has he? Oh, I'm sorry. An occupational hazard, I'm afraid. One has to spend a great deal of time kneeling in my game. <laughs> you want to get your... Norman Bird was born on October 30th, 1924, in Coville, Leicestershire, England. He portrayed the character bank manager in the sitcom when he was 46 years old in 1970. We regret to inform you that in 2005, he passed away at the age of 80, leaving us deeply saddened. Hey, oh, naturally. The Avenue does you all great credit. We should be very distressed to see the uh, ambience of the neighborhood in any way altered. Brian Oton was born on February 11, 1908, in Liverpool, England. He portrayed the character Piano Owner in the sitcom when he was 54 years old in 1962. We regret to inform you that in 1992, he passed away at the age of 84, leaving us deeply saddened. Give him a wife. No, no, just the piano. Oh. Right, so I'll better shoot off and get my offer it. You're off. Oh, yes, of course, you want somebody to help you. Yes, of course, you do that. who is your favorite character in the sitcom Steptoe and Son. If you like this video, I invite you to hit the like button. And if you like this type of content, you can also hit the subscribe button. This is Turn Back Time and I hope you have a wonderful day.